Well, it's the back of the car that we're talking about. It's called a blown diffuser. It's been on the Red Bull since the start of the season. Indeed, their car was designed around it. Now all their championship competitors are racing to catch up and copy it. Renault, Ferrari and Mercedes have it on their car here in Valencia. It'll be on the McLaren and the Williams in Silverstone. Lotus Racing's Chief Technical Officer Mike Gascoigne is going to tell us how it works. Mike, it's, it's, it's really about how you position the exhausts, right? Yeah, I mean, we run a conventional exhaust, very simple, just exits the exhaust gases out of the top of the car, gets it away from the bodywork. What these teams are doing are bringing the exhaust down into this area in front of the tyre because how you manage the airflow around the tyre and around the double diffuser is critical. And they're using the exhaust gases to control that flow. They're not directly blowing into the diffuser as we did in the late 80s and 90s. That produces a very sort of sensitive car on and off throttle. But they're using it to control the airflow around the tyre and improve downforce. Okay, one of the advantages is that it gives you, the team say, maybe half a second. But one of the drawbacks with Mercedes, they found this weekend that it's actually cooking their rear suspension. Yeah, the problem you've got is here we're exiting the exhaust gas as 800 degrees C, the exhaust gas temperature, straight up into the air. Now you're blowing it onto the bodywork. And obviously, all of these components are very temperature sensitive. And that'll be a real issue in today's race. Those that are racing it for the first time, they've got to be very careful under race conditions, 57 laps, that things aren't going to get too hot in that area. OK, are you going to have it on your car later, maybe in the year or next year? For a small team, it's quite a difficult thing for us to develop. We're trying to focus very much on next year's car. We're looking at it, certainly something to implement for next year, uh, maybe for this year. OK, Mike, thanks very much. We'll see you on the grid. Thank you.